there very much. Today I'm going to read a very special book that I really love. It's called Hair Love. And it was written by Academy Award winning creator Matthew A. Cherry, illustrated by Vashti Harrison, a New York Times bestseller. That means a lot of people loved it. Are you ready to listen to one of my favorite books? Ready? My name is Zuri. Zuri is Swahili for beautiful. And I have hair that has a mind of its own. It kinks, coils, curls, every which way. Daddy tells me it is beautiful. That makes me proud. I love that my hair lets me be me. In funky braids with beads, I'm a princess. And when my hair is in two puffs, I am above the clouds like a superhero. Do, 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 do. My hair even does magic tricks. One day, Rocky and I were playing outside when along came the rain. From large to small it went. Presto, just like that. There is nothing my hair can't do. Today, I woke up extra early all by myself. I was too excited to sleep. It's a big day. Daddy was still sleeping though. Shh, I said to Rocky as we tiptoed past him. Lately, Daddy has been worn out. He makes me breakfast, takes me to school, goes to work, picks me up. And yesterday, we went for a bike ride around the park. I think he needs a break. Because today is special, I want a perfect hairstyle. This calls for a professional touch. Crack. Paws off, Rocky. Daddy heard the crash. Zuri, what on earth, he asked. I was only trying to help, I said. Daddy smiled. Can I help too? It'll be a piece of cake, Zuri. Zuru. That was his nickname he called me, Zuru. The first style was a big no way. The second was no better. N no, Daddy. Then Daddy tried slicking my hair back into two puffs. Ow! Daddy yelled. Wait a minute, Daddy said as he reached into the drawer and pulled out a pick. Ta-da! Daddy, really? I said, I'll be right back, he promised. Now, how's that, he asked, pulling a hat down over my eyes. Daddy, come on, we can do better than that. I really need my hair to be special. Don't worry, he said, we'll figure this out. Then, I had a great idea. Daddy gathered all the tools we needed and we were set. Do you see what's on the sink? Yeah, an iPad. Watching carefully, Daddy combed, parted, oiled and twisted. He nailed it. Funky puff buns. Pretty, pretty and so much fun. Rocky, my cat, approved too. Click. 
I put on my superhero cape as the final touch to a perfect look. Click. Do you know what that was? I think it was the door. Where's my Zuzu? Mommy called from the door. She could not get in the house fast enough. Mommy! You've got to be the prettiest Supergirl I have ever seen, she said. And your hair is beautiful, Zuri. Who did it? I looked at Daddy and beamed. Mommy smiled. Very nice. Thank you. We learned from the best. I think my daddy got a little choked up. Daddy said that and he gave my mom a big hug because that's what people do that love each other. My hair is mommy, daddy, and me. It's hair love. Now wasn't that an awesome story about a dad loving his daughter so much that he wanted to take good care of her while her mom was away. I know you guys have dads that you love very much. I have a father who was a combat engineer in the 82nd Airborne Division. Yeah, he's a retired Sergeant Major. My dad was my hero. Sometimes he had to comb our hair when my mom wasn't feeling well. So my dad understands hair love. Boys and girls, yeah, sometimes mommies aren't there and sometimes daddies aren't there and they definitely need a break like Zuri's dad. But understand that we all get through it. Yeah, like I say to my students all the time, this too shall pass. Until the next time very much, I'll see you later. Bye-bye.